This is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. This is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and also comment. Merry Christmas to all my Capricorns out here. We are in Capricorn season, so it's just a double win for you. We in Capricorn season. It's Christmas. See, this is looking really good for you. I appreciate every single Capricorn out here. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and also comment. So we have let your friends help you. So for a lot of my Capricorns, I'm seeing you can have a lot of problems asking for help. You know, me being a Libra personally, I have that issue as well. I might think that's where we can relate a little bit with me being an air sign, you being an earth sign. I feel like for a lot of my Capricorns, asking for help is a problem. Me personally, that's a problem for me. I have a big issue asking for help. We have weddings. So it looks like somebody just got married recently or is planning on getting married or... I can see marriage coming if you're in a relationship. We got true love. So it looks like this is your soulmate. For a lot of my Capricorns, this is the one for you. We got new love. So for those of you that are single, we have a new person has steered your romantic feelings. So there could be somebody new in the picture and you could be thinking about taking things to the next level with them. We have free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. So for a lot of my Capricorns, you gave somebody a little bit too much energy. You gave somebody too much of your energy. We have released your ex. The time has came for you to clear your energy. So for a lot of my Capricorns, this is an ex leering around. I had to get rid of mine. I had to clear the house of those as well. So I understand that too. For a lot of my Capricorns, right now is the time. We're going into the new year. It's your season. Let go of this person. We have getting to know each other. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. So you could be getting to know somebody on an intimate level, like really deep. We have love yourself first. The more self-respect, the more you are romantically attractive. So for a lot of my Capricorns, just showing that you love you and just being a Cap is what attracts somebody to you. We have expressed your love. Go ahead and make that romantic gesture. So I'm getting that. A lot of my Capricorns, you are a leader. You are a cardinal sign along with Aries, Libra, Cancer. So I'm getting that you are wanting to go after somebody right now, especially for those of you that are single. And I'm getting you've been putting this off for a minute. You don't even care anymore when it comes to this. We have keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from the usual type of expectations. So for a lot of my Capricorns, the person that you have in your head is going to be your soulmate. That isn't the person that's going to be a soulmate. And I'm getting what you want and what you need in a soulmate are two totally different things. That might be why some of you are choosing to be single right now because you're waiting on this person and they could already be around. We have unreunited love. There's not enough, enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. So some of you are literally dealing with someone. We have released your ex and now we have this. So some of my Capricorns right now are literally dealing with somebody just to do it. It's almost like you're killing time or like you got an hourglass going, just waiting for time to run out. It's time to go ahead and release this person, especially if you know that it isn't going anywhere. We have pay attention to red flags. The signs are cautioning you. Don't ignore them red flags. I'm getting a lot of you been ignoring red flags and that could be why shit is the way it is right now. Do not ignore those red flags. Those are signs. That's signs from the universe. You know, take what energy resonates, of course, and leave what doesn't for somebody else. We have the four of swords. I'm getting a lot of you protecting yourself right now. We have the page of cups. It's like he's wondering about something. Some of you are wondering. Could be something that you were ashamed about or somebody that hurt you. I'm seeing a lot of you invest right now. We got the emperor. This is my Capricorn man for sure. This is you. This is your energy. Very confident, very aware of what he has, what he brings to the table. Somebody can have a four-year-old. I'm seeing a big money opportunity approach Capricorn. A really big money opportunity approaching you. I'm getting a lot of you have had a lot of opportunities and kind of been putting them off for different reasons. We got broken hearted. So a lot of you are broken hearted right now. You know, take what energy resonates once again and leave what doesn't for somebody else. Somebody could be broken hearted over you. Somebody has a nine-year-old. We got the angel of love in reverse. Yeah, somebody doesn't want love. Since you my single Capricorns that just got out of something or in the process, I'm getting this could be a family issue for some of you. Family could have been involved. Maybe kids could have been involved. Somebody got a four-year-old. We got patience. A lot of you are remaining patient. And you decided to finally walk away from a situation or you're going to. For a lot of my Capricorns, you might not have walked away yet, but you're damn sure planning on it.
Somebody could be 27. I appreciate everything. Capricorn, Merry Christmas. Thank you.